listen for me. But Come on, okay, sorry. Evening, sorry. Ladies and oh, gentlemen, welcome to Homecoming 2013. Are you, wait, are you, wait, are you guys like ready to so thank you for coming and welcome decided. back all the alumni that are here tonight. Tonight's okay, homecoming okay. festivities are okay, about sorry. to begin. I, like, I'm, I'm, I'm In just a moment, we'll be holding our TKA Alumni Hall of Fame induction right. ceremony. After that, TKA alumnus Chad Dorsey from the class of uh, 1999 will lead us in prayer. Chad resides in West Palm Beach and is married to Sandy Bonner and Dorsey, also from the class of 1999. They have three children and are expecting their fourth. After the opening prayer, TK alumni Clara Aliopoulos from the class of 2008 and Colin Aliopoulos from the class of 2010 and senior Clark Aliopoulos will sing our national anthem. During halftime, the TK marching lines will present their homecoming show, A Pirate Life. After the game, the 2013 homecoming court will be presented and the 2013 homecoming king and queen will be crowned. We hope you enjoy tonight's game and all the ceremony surrounding Homecoming 2013.
commemorative plaque and a King's Academy Athletic Hall of Fame polo shirt. Their names will also be added to the Athletic Wall of Fame and the M. Nelson Loveland Sports and Fine Arts Center. The individuals who excel for the Lions who will be inducted this year are, from the class of 2007, Haley and Hillary Neal. Haley and Hillary both excelled in the areas of track and cross country, winning numerous district, regional, and state championships before going on to college where they continued to excel. Haley Neal won nine individual and team state championships in the 1600 meter, 3200 meter, four by 800 meter, and in cross country throughout her time at the King's Academy. She was also named to the All-State team in 2004, 2005, and 2006. In 2007, Haley was a high school Heisman finalist. Haley then went on to compete at both Liberty University and the University of Florida, where she earned both Big South and SEC conference recognition for her athletic prowess, as well as earning all Big South and all SEC academic honors in both track and cross country. While in college, Haley broadened her repertoire by winning individual championships in the Big South steeplechase and indoor and outdoor mile. Off the track, Haley served as the president of UF's Fellowship of Christian Athletes and also served internationally in Kenya with Athletes in Action. Hillary Neal won four individual and team state championships in the 800 meters, 1600 meters, and four by 800 meters while at King's Academy, in addition to being a key member of the 2006 state championship volleyball team. Hillary then led Sanford University's track and cross country teams for four years, serving as Sanford's team captain in 2009, 2010, and 2011. Hillary earned NCAA Division I Academic All-American Honors in 2009 and 2011, in addition to Southern Conference Academic Honors all four years at Sanford. Hillary was named All-Conference First Team 18 times throughout her career at Sanford and won 12 NCAA Division I Individual Conference Championships. She holds eight school records and one Southern Conference record. She was the 2007 2008 Freshman of the Year in cross country and track. Joining Haley and Hillary are their parents, Todd and Sherry Neal, and brothers Andrew from the class of 2011, and Jonathan who is a sophomore here at the King's Academy. <laughs> Together, Haley and Hillary made an impact on life and athletics at the King's Academy before individually going on to impact college track and cross country as well as leading their fellow athletes at their respective universities. Let's give this year's latest alumni Hall of Fame members, Haley and Hillary Neal, from the class of 2007, another round of applause. Congratulations and go Lions!
turn on the audio right here. Yep. And then the co captains for tonight's game. USA, it's live right now. Good job, buddy. Good job, buddy. Good job, buddy. Good job, buddy. Keep up the First for visiting Coral Springs, Coral Springs Christian Academy. Number seven, Hassan Gilman. Number 20, Mike Field. Number 61, Austin Fitzgerald. And number 62, Nick Rivera. For the Lions of the Kings Academy, number three, James Holland. Number five, Dayton Cannon. Number 51, Clark Aliopoulos. Number 53, Grant Pottinger. receive the kickoff and will defend the goal to the north. The officials for tonight's game are from the East Coast Football Officials Association, the referee Ronnie Mason, the umpire James Keogh, the linesman Maria Jackson, the line judge George Ninowski, the back judge, Adam Dopal, and the clock operator, Evan Ortiz. That guy deserves it, that's why. Yeah. Right now. Yeah. Is that Ninowski or? And here come the Lions. Turn you off as you're talking. Turn you off as you're talking. I'm sorry. I know. Not real loud. She says, you know, it's not loud. It's not loud. But I'm going to do that. At the microphone, we were messing with this thing. It was up as loud as it was. We just fixed the score once. The Lawrence comes back down. You can do it. You can do it. I'll be able to. Oh, that's a good one. Do you want to go find out? Crusaders, number 20, Mike Field, back deep for the Lions, number 3, James Holland, number 5, Nate Cannon.
tackle by number one, Jaleel Chester, for the Crusaders. Timeout on the field, the officials timeout for an injury.
player for the Crusaders, number 60, Joseph Dante.
around the five yard line.
Just to remind all of you, I'm encouraged to stop by the Olympic Clubhouse and the next receive a voucher for a free meal and a way of expressing thanks for coming to
for the Lions. Second half, number one, Paul Schumacher. Return to the Crusaders. Number four, Tony Reed. And number 20, Mike Field. Kickoff sales to the end zone for a first and four for the Raiders at their own point. Number 23, Day on Donaldson, get the carry for the Crusader. Thank 
Well, it's the Lions first. Holding on, Sanders. 
down by number
tackle by number seven, Hassan Gilliam for the Crusaders. Loss is to the Crusader 25 yard line. Second down.
being on number one tackled by number fifty-one, Clark Aliano. Yes. To the 
46 line good for
is Miss Ashley Elizabeth Staff. <laughs> Ashley is the daughter of Bob and Nancy Staff of West Palm Beach. She is 17 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for 14 years. She is escorted this evening by her father, Mr. Bob Staff. A special passage of scripture that Ashley would like to read with you is Psalm 139, 7 through 10. Where can I go from your spirit? Where can I flee from your presence? If I go up to the heavens, you are there. If I make my bed in the depths, you are there. If I rise on the wings of the dawn, if I settle on the far side of the sea, even there your hand will guide me. Your right hand will hold me fast. Again, this actually is that. The seventh number this evening is Miss Katie Lynn Wynn. Kate is the daughter of Kevin and Robin Wentz of West Palm Beach. She is 17 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for 14 years. Katie is escorted this evening by her father, Mr. Kevin Wentz. A special verse she would like to leave you with is found in Isaiah 40, 31. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not be faint. Again, Miss Katie Wentz. The eighth member of the 2013 Homecoming Court is Miss Daisy Shane Wilkinson. <laughs> Daisy is the daughter of Tom and Gail Wilkinson of Wellington. She is 18 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for five years. Daisy is escorted this evening by her father, Mr. Tom Wilkinson. A special scripture verse that Daisy would like to share with you is John 3.30. He must become greater, I must become less. Again, I'd like to introduce you to Miss Daisy Shane Wilkinson. The ninth member of the Homecoming Court of 2013 is Miss Gina Nasser Babawi. Gina is the daughter of Dr. Nasser Babawi and Miss Yvette McGow of Palm Beach Gardens. She is 17 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for 13 years. Gina is escorted this evening by her brother, Kevin Nasser Babawi. A special scripture she would like to share with you is Colossians 2, 6 through 7. You have accepted Christ Jesus as your Lord. Now keep on following him. Plant your roots in Christ and let him be the foundation for your life. Be strong in your faith, just as you were taught, and be grateful. Miss Gina Nasser Babali. The 10th member of the homecoming court being presented this evening is Mr. Clark Stephen Aliopoulos. Clark is the son of Mark Aliopoulos and Amy Clark of West Palm Beach. He is 17 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for eight years. Clark is escorted this evening by his mother, Mrs. Amy Clark. A special scripture verse that he would like to share with you is John 16, 33. I have told you these things so that in me you may have peace. In this world you will have trouble, but take heart, I have overcome the world. Mr. Clark Stephen Aliopoulos. The 11th member of the homecoming court is Mr. Nicholas Stephen Bates. Nicholas is the son of Stephen and Elizabeth Bates of West Palm Beach. He is 17 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for six years. Nicholas is escorted this evening by his mother, Mrs. Elizabeth Bates. A special scripture verse he would like to share with you is Isaiah 40:31. But those who trust in the Lord will find new strength. They will soar high on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not faint. Again, Mr. Nicholas 
Stephen Bates. Our 12th member of the 2013 Homecoming Court this evening is Mr. Matthew Thomas Fritz. Matthew is the son of David and Karen Fritz of Wellington. He is 18 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for 13 years. He is escorted this evening by his mother, Mrs. Karen Fritz. A special scripture verse that Matt would like to share with you is Isaiah 40, 31. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not be faint. Again, Mr. Matthew Fritz. The 13th member of the homecoming court is Mr. James Antonio Holland. James is the son of Carl Hutchinson and Rena Holland of Royal Palm Beach. He is 17 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for seven years. James is escorted this evening by his mother, Mrs. Rena Holland. A special scripture verse that James would like to share with you is Philippians 4.13. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Mr. James Antonio Holland. The 14th member of the homecoming court is Mr. Garrett Riley Larson. Garrett is the son of Richard and Rosario Larson of Lake Worth. He is 17 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for 14 years. Garrett is being escorted this evening by his mother, Mrs. Rosario Larson. A scripture verse that means a lot to Garrett is Matthew 6, 33. But seek first his kingdom and his righteousness, and all these things will be added to you as well. Again, Mr. Garrett Larson. The 15th member of the 2013 Homecoming Court is Mr. Christian Alejandro Rodriguez. Christian is the son of Miguel and Christina Rodriguez of West Palm Beach. He is 17 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for 10 years. Christian is being escorted this evening by his mother, Mrs. Christina Rodriguez. A special scripture verse that Christian would like to share with you is Psalm 18, 1 through 2. I love you, Lord. You are my strength. The Lord is my rock, my fortress, and my savior. My God is my rock, in whom I find protection. He is my shield, the power that saves me, and my place of safety. Again, Mr. Christian Rodriguez. The 16th member of the 2013 Homecoming Court is Mr. Jerry Paul Schumacher III. Paul is the son of Jerry and Annette Schumacher of North Palm Beach. He is 17 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for four years. Paul is escorted by his mother, Mrs. Annette Schumacher. A verse that Paul would like to share with you is Jeremiah 29 11. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. Again, Mr. Paul Schumacher. The 17th and final member of the 2013 Homecoming Court is Mr. Zachary Michael Shorts. Zach is the son of Michael and Christina Schwartz of Royal Palm Beach. He is 17 years of age and has attended the King's Academy for eight years. He is escorted by his mother, Mrs. Christina Schwartz. A special scripture verse that Zach would like to share with you is Philippians 4.13. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Again, Mr. Zach Schwartz.
And now it is our distinct pleasure and privilege to have with us this evening the King's Academy 2012 Homecoming Queen, Miss Kat Urso. Kat is currently a freshman at Florida State University and is studying nursing. She will be crowning our new 2013 Homecoming Queen. Please also join me in welcoming the King's Academy 2012 Homecoming King, Mr. Michael Habib. <laughs> Michael is currently a freshman at the University of Florida and is majoring in economics with a minor in Spanish. He will be crowning our new 2013 Homecoming King. Also joining the, the two of them is Miss Isabella Wise. Isabella is a second grade student in Mrs. Hamilton's class here at the King's Academy. Her favorite subjects are Bible and reading. She loves to dance, ride, and play the piano. She will be assisting Kat and Michael in the crowning. And now I'm going to open up the envelope and announce our 2013 homecoming queen. Drum roll, please. Our 2013 homecoming queen is Miss Ashley Elizabeth Stack. congratulate all the members of the female homecoming court and especially to Ashley, our new homecoming queen. And now I would like to present to you our homecoming king. Please drum roll. Our homecoming king for 2013, Mr. Clark Stephen Aliopoulos. At this time, I would like to congratulate all the male members of our 2000 homecoming court. Let's give them a round of applause. We would now like for our 2013 Homecoming King and Queen to take the 50-yard line as we all congratulate them on this special honor. Give our king and queen a round of applause. Thank you again for attending tonight's 2013 homecoming game and the crowning of our king and queen. Have a blessed weekend. You guys rock. Thank God we fixed that one. Thank you. I hope Thank you. He turned it off and on again. Oh, it's a solution. Yep. And they heard that. Yep. Thank you for watching. Sorry for the mishap. There is this killer. Welcome to video world. Make sure you don't put it in the water.